Hello guys. I am busy stocking our shelves here. Um, this has taken me forever, but, uh, and I keep falling through the world. I think I'm, I think I've maxed out this, uh, this house with stuff. Okay. I think that's probably pretty good. I've gone through and I have, yeah, I think I've got most things. Oh, we should get some pickles though. Let's put some pickles on here. There. Kind of fit it between the pastry and the alcohol. <laughs> um, I'm not going to bother. Oh, I do have some stuff up there. That's right. I'm not going to bother over there. We'll just pretend that's full. But we got our, our shelves pretty full. We even got a whole shelf dedicated to those hot dogs. <laughs> Um, so we have our broom back here and, oh, I got to put this door back in place, uh, cause I had to move it. I was having a hard time moving around. So, okay. We'll leave it like about like that. Yeah. Um, I'm just trying to finish up. Like I still have some stuff to do guys, but I'm trying to put some pictures up. This has been taking a really long time. Um, okay. So this is what I have so far. Uh, I've, I've put a few pictures up. It, it's, I'm kind of all over the place with the colors of frames. I, I put a black frame in here because we do have some black, uh, stuff going on in here. So I thought it kind of matched, but I'm sort of been kind of playing with all kinds of colors and I don't think it looks too bad. I found this fridge. This is a nice looking fridge somebody made. I really like it. But we got a bag of groceries here. I finished off this wall with just a couple of cabinets. I didn't put anything in here. I probably should put like wine glasses or something at least or I don't know. Yeah, probably. Let's just see if we can grab a few right now while I'm thinking about it. Uh, what kind of, let's grab these ones. I think they're short enough. Yeah. Yeah. We'll put maybe this could be the wine. Is this like narrower? Yeah. I think the middle shelf might be a little bit shorter. So we'll put a few wine glasses and can we, can we get in there a little bit better? There we go. Okay. Yeah. We'll, we'll do something like that. Okay, and then uh, we might as well grab maybe these ones. We'll put the tall ones up here. And we'll just kind of scatter them in and about. We should put them in nicely. Those That's kind of a di display cabinet, but that's good enough. Mm, is there anything? Oh, I think we need like a pitcher. I've been kind of, I have a little bit of green going on. So maybe we'll get a green pitcher. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's put it in here. And then we could put a couple of glasses in here too. I think that would be nice. Uh, let's get some whiskey glasses. Why not? Okay. I think that's good. Okay. At least that has something in it. I feel better about that. Yeah, we use the milk, we use the eggs. I put a, oh, 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 darn it. I sold it by accident. That's right, I had a, a crib. I bought a crib and, oh, no, not a crib, uh, a high chair. Is it called a high chair? High chair or, yeah, high chair, white. I think I bought a white one. So I've put the baby thing here and we got some bottles over there. This is where we're gonna kind of park the little the baby thing the baby thing and yeah I think I liked it right where it was it's fine got some baby bottles some milk um just putting lots of little decorations on here I even have like this little thing there's probably so much more I can be putting in but I just uh this is as far as I've got I put pots up on these shelves and I tried to, I th decided to play around with just putting pictures up here. So I've been putting them on the wall and knocking them off. So it looks like they're just sitting on the shelf and there's still a few more I'd like to try. It's, it's kind of like helping fill in the spaces. We should try to find one for there actually. Uh, let's have a look here. Cause there's still pictures I haven't used yet. We still have to do blinds and I haven't put any color on the walls and I think I'm kind of liking it like that. So 
I might just leave it. Now this would be a cute one to use because it has spoons. Um, you know what? Let's put it, uh, actually, let's put it right here. I'm going to just switch these things around. We're going to put this over here. And let's put maybe this. Actually, you know what? Let's do a little bit bigger of a picture. Let's see if we can just make it just a, a smidge bigger. Yeah, I think that would be cute there. So let's see if we can. I'm just trying to get them to, yeah, just kind of plop on the shelf like that. Yeah, okay. And then we need something in that corner. Maybe something down here. But that's kind of what I've, I've got potatoes. We're, we're busy baking in here. <laughs> we got a loaf of bread. She's got so much going on and four babies. No, more than that. She has like six kids. There's four babies and two little, little boys. Okay. And so then I decided to put a dog bed in here. Like this family has a dog. I think the retro side is going to have a cat. Um, so this is all I've done. Okay. Let's go upstairs. I, I haven't done much in here other than just, it's really plain, but it's just like a hallway. So I just kind of tried to use the same color frames. Um, and I just kind of used bluish colors in here. So I think this looks pretty cute. Uh, we have no lights. Uh, yeah, we have to put lights in. I think I'm going to use halogens for the most part though, but you come downstairs and there's just a couple of pictures here. It sort of starts to tie in the blue from upstairs and well, there's pink upstairs too with the pink. And then in here, um, like this is pretty typical for like a farmhouse picture, but I thought it looked really cute. Brings in some of that rustic-y kind of dark wood. This is the couch I ended up with. It's from the, from the workshop. Okay, you guys, you know what? You guys are just freaking me out. Let's just put you back put you back over here because I've just had enough of you guys. This is the couch that I ended up replacing because okay, yeah, you guys are creeping me out. Um, anyway, uh, I still have to put stuff on the shelves. As you can see, I'm not quite done. Um, but this is one of the ones from the workshop. It was, you know, it's, it's cozy enough, I guess. But I really liked all the different kinds of pillows. I wish they were slightly different pillows. But once we had the pink pillow, because we don't really have much in these colors, I decided to go with pink decorations. And I used these chairs. They were kind of small enough. And I liked the color of the legs. So we're gonna we're just gonna go with that. And as far as like this, I just don't know what to decorate yet. We're gonna add in some more plants and stuff. We still gotta do blinds. But this is kind of what I have going on so far. So this, oh, I found this table. This is like the style that I was kind of going with. I just wish it was a different color, but I decided to just go with it. It doesn't really match that frame, but I like this picture. I just wish I had like maybe that darker frame that would look nicer. Hmm. I don't know. I might switch it around, but anyway, I don't think much has happened. She's got grocery bags all over the place. Uh, this, uh, I don't think I was going to keep there. I think I was going to put it on. I don't know. This is too tall, too tall. So, you know what? We'll just leave it there for now. Yeah, you know, maybe we'll move it a little bit closer. Yeah, we'll probably put some more plants and stuff, but I'm kind of liking this. We've got a couple of magazines and I think it looks really homey here. What I wanted to do was layer pictures, like kind of lean pictures on each other. If that makes any sense, but it's near impossible to do. I tried to knock some off the wall and see if I could get them to fall together, but it really didn't work out. So I thought, well, I'll just put this one kind of on the mantle. I have this one in the background. I would like to put something else small in front of it. Maybe like, I don't know, candle or something. I feel like it just needs a little bit more. So we got our little dog. I don't know what to name you, but you're pretty cute. You're pretty cute. A little bit weird nose, but 
<laughs> anyway, I decided on that color for the dog bed. I thought that's maybe a good place for it because we're running out of space. We picked out the table together. They did have some farm chairs in the warehouse where work workshop now. I don't know why I'm calling it warehouse. Um, but I kind of liked I kind of liked mine. They were pretty rusticy, pretty cute, but I already have these, so we're going to stick with that and I might set the table. I don't know yet. We've got the bench still and we still need blinds and lights. But I like the way this turned out. I just kind of used these kind of I had three similar kind of pictures, so I decided to go with a little bit more blue and get away from the pink a little bit. And then we just used these. I just ended up building out a wall and I used these cabinets here that I thought maybe would work okay. Um, okay, you have to go outside, goat. Out you go. Out you go. Greatest of all time and all, but yeah, you gotta go. And chicken, you gotta go outside too. These, these animals are out of control. The dog can stay. But the chickens, I mean, bunnies, you know, they're, they're okay to be inside, but we're going to, yeah, you guys are all going outside. There you go. Okay, let's shut the door so they don't, pigs trying to get in. Um. Okay, so yes, we're getting there. I want to add a few more little details. I think the pantry's done. And like I said, carpets, light, a few more things. Let's just find a picture really quick together okay so I've used the spoon one did I use this one y'all come and eat um, did I use that one yet no bacon is always the secret ingredient I thought that was cute okay I want to use that that one the the y'all come and eat one okay oh we could maybe throw in some green that might be kind of nice oh I like the shape of that um yeah yeah I think this will be good I want to make it maybe a smidge bigger I want it to fill in this corner nicely so let's oh that didn't work out well we could try whacking it one more time see what happens no Nope, not working out. Hopefully we can get it to land a little better than that. Okay, perfect. That's what I want right there. Yeah. Let's move this plate over a little bit. Okay. I'm liking this. It's kind of like cute. I don't know. I don't know if that's a thing people do, but I like it. So farmer's market, we got family we got the spoons we got eggs bacon um okay let's have a look and see what else we can do this is a cute one uh just a moo picture uh sheep we could do sheep i don't know i'm getting tired of this frame i got a lot with this kind of frame the kitchen one wouldn't be too bad Mm. yeah we don't have too many of the gray frames we could put that kind of right can we make that maybe just a smidge smaller yeah let's do that that'll fill in this spot really nice perfect so cute I like it it's turning out really cute okay is there anything else I think I put this one farm sweet farmhouse I think is above the door in the brown I think you know actually now that I see the black one it wouldn't be bad to put a little bit more black in here I think you know what I'm gonna switch these out it's a small little thing but yeah, I, I just feel like it. I feel like it, so we're going to do it. Let's do 45. Is that about the right size? I think it's about the right size. I think I'll just like it with the gray frame on this wall better. That is so not centered. This is such a tight little corridor, but I like having the pantry. I think it turned out good. Um. Okay, so we need something over here, but it'll be something else. I'm not sure what. 
Um, we still should put a coffee maker out, that kind of stuff. But let me just see if there's any other pictures we must have in here. Uh, I've used all these upstairs. Um, let's stay home. Oh, I liked this tractor picture. Life is better in the country. I want to use that somewhere. Uh, where could we use that? Hmm. Um, I mean, we could kind of put it up here, maybe. And we could move that pot, or we could put it here, but it kind of gets lost on the wall. I don't think we have really room for much more as far as pictures. Uh, this will just fall down behind it, so we'll have to just find something else to put on there. Hmm. 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 Um. Just looking at that, that frame might have been nice paired here. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know, but I want to use it somewhere. We do have it in a darker frame. Uh. I don't know. I kind of like just the light one. It might be kind of nice just maybe up there. I, I think that's what we're going to do. But we're going to make it bigger because that tractor is really tiny. So this one we might make really... Is that too big? Maybe that's a little too big for what we got going on up here. So let's put that here. And then I am going to... You know, I don't know. Let's just, I'm going to just move that pot a little bit and let's just see what we can do here. Okay, I like that. Yeah. Can we move this in a bit? Yeah, let's do that. I like, yeah, that's good. I like it. I didn't put anything here either. Oh gosh, I'm never going to be done this house. But you know what? I want to get this video out to you guys. So <sighs> what can we put there? We need like a tile thing, but I don't think I have anything in my gallery that would work. I was going to use llamas. For some reason, I had this idea to use llamas everywhere. I like llamas, but uh, I never used any of the pictures. Um, Could that pass as a, a big tile? Probably not. Hmm. Could that pass is like, no, I don't know. I'm not sure what to do. I mean, we could like, um, make our own little, I found this in the workshop too, but it's kind of getting in the way of, I don't know. I'm just worried it's going to get in the way if I do a, pot, a tile thing back there. We'll just leave it for now. But I think this hip, yeah, this one edge is going to be a problem. So we may have to switch that around. I am liking this though a lot. I'm just trying to think of what else I could. Yeah, I have, yeah, I have to do stuff. You know what, guys? Let me finish. Let me just, because otherwise this is going to end up being way too long. I'll put the lights in. I'll put the blinds in, but I, and the carpets, and maybe just finish up the shelving. We're pretty close. Like I said, I just want to put something there. And I think the rest is okay. I thought I was going to put a lot of plates and stuff, but I actually kind of like the mixture of all the different things so it's looking pretty homey let's turn that on yeah i i think i'll leave like the pantry or the the island pretty plain but i am liking it i am liking it okay let me finish guys i will be back okay guys i am going to stop here because i will never stop i will just never stop Anyway, I added lights. Uh, yeah, we have a light here. Oh, I forgot to put something here. Oh my gosh. I'm never going to be done. Never, ever. Okay, let's just find a plant. 
let's find a plant and we'll put a plant there. What kind of plant would look good? Let's go into plants. Um, I was thinking after, I'm like, oh, baby pictures would have been really cute since we've got the baby thing going on, but I did not prepare for that. So, uh, what kind of plant is a good size? Um, I don't know. I can't find the right size. That one's so small. I'm trying to find something kind of in between this one and that one, but, uh, how big is that? Let's... I mean, we could actually do a little bit of color. Uh, you know, the pink isn't bad. Pink isn't too bad. It's pretty small, but I don't know. That looks lost there. What if we put a bunch of them together? I don't know. Oh gosh, I gotta get like finished with this thing already. Mm. If it wasn't such a terrible color, right? Uh, it's about the right size is what I'm thinking, but. Mm, I don't know. I don't know, guys. I just, I'm drawing a blank now. I think I've just been at this too long. Uh, oh, here's some pink ones. How big are you? A little bit bigger? Perfect. Okay, let's get rid of that and we'll put this right here and it has some greenery too. So I think that's perfect. Okay. Okay. So we have lights. Um, it's getting really laggy in here. So uh, I, I think I just added, I just kind of put some decorations. I think I added a couple plants well in the vases. So our story begins here. Uh, I think, I don't know if I had all these pictures in, but I'll just kind of, I didn't really add too much to this room. I just kind of, I don't know. I think it's, it's good. I do like the colors though. I think it turned out really good. We just have the halogens up there. Um, on the mantle, I just kind of grouped a few things together. I think that looks okay. And in here, I don't think I changed anything up here. Uh, nothing really. I just added a couple plants. Really basic. I mean, it's just a hallway. I didn't feel like really putting too much work into it. Okay. And in here we got some lights. I just grouped those ones together. I thought that kind of, that style kind of suited this whole look. Uh, I think I added a picture up there and I thought, well, well I didn't want to set the whole table. So I thought, let's have birthday cake. I mean, with all these kids, it's bound to be somebody's birthday. So uh, we have birthday cake and just some plates and stuff. I tried to use the light blue because we had that going on. And uh, this whole ledge, I'm not crazy about, but yeah, I, I don't know what I'm doing. Really, honestly, I don't know what I'm doing. I can't put anything up there. You have to like drop it on. So it's too much of a hassle. But you know, I think we could find somewhere to put this in the kitchen. I just don't like that. I don't know. I just didn't like the way that looked. I don't know where to put this. Well, we could put something. I don't. <laughs> I'm trying to find a space for this. Okay, let's just look. You know, I feel like. We could use something tall in this corner for some reason. So let's just see if I can move this over a tiny little smidge. Got a green, oop, got a green mark there. <gasps> what? How did that fall down? What? I did nothing. Why? Why did you fall down? You better go back up. That's all I can say. After I did all this, you better go back up here. Okay, good. Okay, you're lucky. Wait. Why are you far away from the... Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. 
Okay, there we go. Got it. I don't know why that fell down. Anyway, yeah, we'll leave it up there. I just didn't like it over there. So anyway, I ended up putting just the neutral color uh, Rowan blinds up. And in here, I just used one of the workshop rugs, just very neutral. Same thing with the, the blinds over there. A few halogens, nothing too crazy. And yeah, those lights. And then the same thing in here. I ended up, uh, where's the lights here? Um, putting the same light kind of grouping above the island. Uh, I didn't want it to kind of come down too low. And then I just put halogens pretty much everywhere. And I think I even snuck in my llama picture. And I think that's about it. Other than just maybe a few little details. I think actually we did most of this together. So I think we're done, guys. I think we're done with this. If there's more I'm going to add, I'll tell you about it next time. But I think it turned out really cute. That pretty much completes our our modern farmhouse you'll have to let me know I mean this was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be but I think it does have a really you know a modern farmhouse kind of feel to it so hopefully we did okay I really really like the kitchen this is like a dream kitchen honestly um, and I really like the pantry I'm really glad we we did that and I think um, what we'll do is I, I'm going to play around with the outside to one day, but that pretty much completes the inside. I am going to shut off these lights because it is terribly, terribly laggy. So, hey guys, uh, welcome back. I actually took a little bit of a break. I was really starting to peter out at the end of that video and I felt like I was just kind of rushing it to try and get it out to you guys. And then I decided, as you know, to split it into two because I didn't realize how long it was. I had a look at it and I started editing, editing the first part and I was like, oh, but you forgot to do this and you forgot to do that. And <laughs> so I'm like, I want to come back and finish it. But I was just too tired. Like I was, I had been just too tired that night. So I, there was one more thing I wanted to find and then we're going to end this. Um, it was that, I wanted that teal color tool. There it is. This is it yeah I wanted to put this in here because it matched that pillow so I thought maybe we could just kind of use that as a decoration somewhere not sure where I guess we could put it there this one kind of needs something whoa geez uh, let's just oh gosh every time I put these down the the chairs kind of jiggle and hmm can we put it up top here with this guy not really uh, Let's just see what we can do here. Sorry, I should have did this before I didn't know it was going to be so fiddly. So fiddly. Um, can we fit that in now? Yeah, I just felt like it needed something. I'm not digging those candles for some reason. I don't know why. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. We'll leave it like that. We have a couple things on the shelves anyway. I ended up changing these lights. Um, doesn't even look, oh, I guess it is on. Uh, yeah, I just thought, well, since we did those kind of lights in here, and then I actually changed this. I actually put a little collage of pictures up. I thought it just needed a little more. I switched, I think I had a vase under there. I put a basket and I changed what's on this shelf. I put another light and I think that looks really cute. So are the lights on or off? Yeah, I guess they're off. Um, yeah, I started shutting them off before we ended. That's right. So, um, yeah, so I just kind of added that and then I changed, I think this carpet, I just went with one with a little bit of design uh, and it's a little bit lighter color. Didn't blend as, as much into the floor. So I like that because like the, the stripy part kind of matches the blind. So I don't think I did anything more in here. I didn't do anything there. I added some carpets upstairs as you saw when I logged in. Uh, and I think I changed this. I was really not liking that. So I started um, trying to find some other stuff to decorate with. And between the workshop and the regular game, I found some stuff and I'm happy with it now. I put a couple of baskets up there. 
and I don't think I did anything. Oh, I put some Coke glasses up with the cake. We'll just sugar those kids up real good. Baskets, yeah. And then in here, I decided I found a tree of life. This is what I, I would love this in, in my real life. The tree of life, um, there was a copper kind of uh, backsplash. And I thought maybe we could use that just to break that up. So uh, unfortunately, our utensils no longer fit. I forgot about them over here. So I think we're going to put those right here. And maybe we'll even just kind of move this over a tiny little bit. Yeah, there. Just so it doesn't look quite so crowded. You know what we need? We need a knife. We need a knife to cut our bread. How are we going to... Uh, <laughs> Uh, let's learn how to spell knife. Um, survival? Brushy? Knife? I don't know what all these knives are. Okay, this is the one I think we want. So, yeah, there we go. Probably not safe to have a knife hanging over the counter like this with babies around. But, now yeah, we could cut our bread for supper to go with the... We'll call this chili. And, yeah. Okay, and then I think... That's about it. Yeah, I do like that a lot. The stove, like the stove top is a little bit off center. I've realized that I did not put a dishwasher in here. That would have been really nice to have, but I'm not going to fuss, fuss with it now. But other than that, I think I may have added a few more pictures here and there. Yeah, I think like this one's new. Um, I think I put this one in. We just needed a few more. I'm absolutely loving this whole kind of idea of just leaning pictures and just having a few little knickknacks on there. Not a, not at all what I thought I was going to do with these shelves. I didn't know what to do with them, but I think that really fills them in nicely. And it's just, I love the collage effect of all the different frames and colors and types and that kind of thing. And I think, yeah, I think we're good, guys. Uh, I didn't put a coffee maker in, but we'll just pretend that there's one in the cupboard there somewhere. But I think other than that, like I said, uh, I think we're done. I put a different, uh, I use the same carpet in here just to kind of break it up a little bit. We never did um, change the tile in the floor, and I don't mind, actually. And another thing, like I just, I was going to paint some feature walls, but you know, now with all of the stuff that we have decorating, it breaks up the wall enough that and I, I just don't think that color belongs in here I think we did a pretty good job of adding it in other ways so I didn't think I was gonna go shiplap everywhere but I'm happy I'm happy with the results so yeah I think we're done guys I can't think of anything else I did next time we'll play I, I might group like I said the backyards together and do some I started just like every time I came across something that I thought I might use I just threw it on the ground so um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe we'll, who knows? Uh, these are the fences that I think I started to mention one day and I thought, well, maybe we could play with those and pen off the animals or <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we should just scrap the animal idea, but I think it's really funny. Um, there was this huge barbecue. I thought that may be nice outside, but I think we'll just kind of maybe group the, the farm and the retro backyards at the same time or something. But I think this pretty much calls the inside of this done and we will be off to the retro side so anyway guys I hope you enjoyed thank you guys so much for watching I hope you're mm. you know what I don't I don't like that picture well I guess it'll be okay it's just a really kind of a darker blue we don't have the darker Oh, whatever. There was one other picture I wanted to use that had this same kind of flowers in it. That would have been perfect in there, but for some reason it just didn't go to my gallery and I just stopped fighting with it. So yeah, that's, that's kind of bugging me now. One sec. Okay. Yeah. I can't find that picture I wanted to use. It's, it was just one that I had to crop and it matched perfectly. But when I cropped it and resaved it, it was this one. I tried to cut out this white border. Um, but as you can see, this color would have been really, really nice in here. But instead we're going to use this one because I just didn't like the dark blue of that picture and it was bugging me. So now we have a cow really doesn't match with anything okay i'm just gonna quit guys hopefully we have captured the the idea of a modern farmhouse you guys will have to let me know i tried my best 
But I am out of here, guys. And next time, we will meet you on the retro side. Woohoo! Look at that. I even put mailboxes out here. We've got to put doorbells. We're still going to do all the yards. I think the front will probably just put a, I don't know, maybe just a little bench and some bunnies playing in the yard or something. I'm not sure. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. We will see you next time. Bye-bye.